Hello and welcome to this chapter. In this chapter, we are going to be creating the repeater. Not the repeater table, but the repeater. So the repeater allows you to freeform create a report or a dashboard. As you can see on my screen, I don't have a list in the sense of you know pulling a list onto the screen or a cross tab or, or a chart. You see that this is a bit of a freeform sort of dashboard. You see, I have some tests that I typed in, and I'm also pulling data from my data module, right? I'm combining some raw tests with elements from the database. And I've styled this up a little bit. I wanted to show you guys what you can do in terms of, you know, making your, your dashboards look nice. So I went online and I copied some, some, um, some links, and I used that as a background image. And all you are seeing is, you know, the days of the week and the average temperatures. You know, I have the average temperature for um, Monday as 49, and I have styled it using the um, the pattern. This is this is the way you can use you can use a pattern to style your numbers so that you know I can have my Fahrenheit looking like the way it is 49.9 uh, with an F. And uh, I'm using a singleton here. I'm using a regular, I believe, data item here. And uh, I'm using the style again to convert this value and format it with an MPH. So I'm showing Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Sunday. And I use the repeater. So let's go and create this. We are going to go with one column theme of cool gray. And we are going to connect to my data source. So let's find the data module, weather analytics. So the first thing I'm going to do is I need to think about what it is that I'm going to create, okay? I see that I'm going to be creating, uh, let's go back to the basic. I see that I'm going to be creating a layout that looks like this. So first of all, I'm studying it, you know, which is something that you should do. You should probably um, create a mock-up of what it is that you're looking to develop but me usually when I'm creating I get creative you see but since I've already created this and I'm looking to create something similar I'm going to study what I did here so what do I see here I see a table with one two three four four rows okay so this is a repeater but there's a table inside this repeater all right so so to begin, I'm going to start by first